With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question here says which of the following is correct. So the first statement here is that the ribosome, the S, that is the Swedberg's unit, what we call it as S, that is the 80S ribosome or 70S ribosome, we write S there, right? So this is the Swedberg unit and it is the measure of the sedimentation coefficient, it represents the sedimentation coefficient. So that means more the sedimentation coefficient, more is the value of S here. While it is an indirect measure of the density and size and not a direct measure. So this statement which is given here is a false statement. The second one says both animal and plant cells have well defined cell wall. While in the animal cell, cell wall will be absent. So there is no cell wall. So this also becomes a false statement. The third one is content of nucleolus is organized continuous with the rest of the nucleoplasm as it is a membrane bound organelle. Remember, nucleolus is a non-membrane bound organelle. So, this becomes a false statement as well. While the fourth statement that nucleus as a cell organelle was first described by Robert Brown in the year 1831, this statement is a true statement. So, that means it was described by this scientist Robert Brown and the year is also correctly given here. So, we can mark option number 4 as the right answer for this question. Whereas the other options which are given here, they are the wrong ones. This is all about this query. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.